I used to take dozens of test paper each week. Therefore, there is no wonder that I use up five pens each month. If you ask me how I spend my daily life, either in the bed or here. I went to Guangzhou Library in the weekend or holidays. Actually, I have to go there because weekly exam always coming on Monday. Yes, the exam for night subjects. Sometimes I would like to study intensively with my friend rather than looking for a girlfriend. The only thing that I enjoyed in my high school was playing basketball. If all of this disappears suddenly, I might feel lost. Study for 12 years, every Chinese high school student will face the Gao Kao. There is no shortcut on this way, only by spending all my time on it. Then I would not be left behind the other students. It was a hard time, but that's the only way we can choose. My parents told me. All of my hard work will pay off. My teachers told me, if I do something that others don't feel like doing, then I will get reward that others cannot get. They told me so just because Gao Kao determined my future. It's an exam for all, and you only got one shot. I couldn't imagine a student working so hard, but they cannot. Earn what they want. Students feel extreme amount of pressure from the Gao Kao because it will determine which colleges they can attend. When applying for colleges in America, students are either accepted or denied based on their GPA, SAT, ACT. And extracurricular activities, while colleges in China accept or deny students based only on the Gao Kao. Pressure is felt from both parents, schools, and the country. One-child policy is the reason why there is a very high pressure for their one and only son or daughter to do well in their future and be successful. The Gao Kao results in schools putting all their attention on how to get good grades because high schools focus on their college admission rates. Academic pressure is so high that the practice of solving test problems will be repetitive, and also because completely ignoring non-test subjects, students don't learn things that are not on the test. The pressure is a great concern, and some even claim that high school students in China are the most pressured and unhappy group of students in the world. Um, 作为一个传统的中国学生，我同样参加了很多的补课班，在初三、高三经历了无数的晚自习，做了很多的卷子和模拟考试，呃、参加了正常的高考、呃。高考我以全省前百分之零点五的成绩，考进了全中国的山东大学，进入了本科阶段的学习。嗯，那你？进入了像山东大学这么好的大学以后，你你的感受是什么？进入大学之后，跟我想象中的样子是有些差距的。嗯，在本科的学习过程中，因为教育体制和教育环境的影响，学生之间的差异化会非常大。有自独立的孩子会学习非常的好，嗯，但如果同学们互相都不学习，在一起互相影响的话。会会非常的颓废，像我的本科室友在一起互相打游戏，在毕业的时候仅以及格的成绩步入社会参加工作，这也是为什么我选择出国读书的原因。Hi Nikki. Hi. Have you ever take Gao Kao exam before? Uh, no, I came. United States from the junior high school, and I started with tenth grade. Okay, so why you go abroad so early as a、uh, high school student? 
honestly I'm not good at studying and especially for something I don't like it that much and in China they all force every student to learn the same thing there and I think go protest is exam oriented based education and I prefer more creative study environment like here okay so how do you feel about Gaokao? Uh, I don't know that much about Gaokao tests, but every year I saw a huge number of students study for that. I think they're so crazy and uh, I'm so scared for that. Also, I felt lucky that I escaped from Gaokao. Okay, thank you. marks on the exam are set to determine their entire future life opportunities and earning potential in China, with a belief that those who excel on the test will have the best careers and even marriage prospects. College entrance is especially competitive in China, where the top universities only select as few as 1 in 50,000 students. Wow! That's pretty low. That's like 0.002%. The test is so important that factories and buildings will shut down while the exam is underway as police cars patrol to keep streets quiet. Ambulances are placed outside exam facilities in case of nervous collapses. The multiple choice questions are notoriously hard with questions such as Last October, President Xi Jinping said that while art is based on imagination, it should still be down to earth. There may be hundreds of ways to create art. The best way, however, is to trace back to the people's daily lives and create something based off that. From a materialism point of view, this is because, one, art originates from the daily lives of people. Two, art depends on innovation. Three, the way art reflects on society and its style is unified. Four, art is a form of ideology that reflects people's lives while at the same time serving the people. God, this is confusing. I don't, I have no idea. <laughs> it's like kind of a logic question, but it's also a grammar question. And it's also related to current events and politics. Just reading this gives me anxiety, so I can understand why people have ambulances outside. It's saying the same thing. The Gaokao has been seen as symbolic of the Chinese education system as a whole. And both the exam and the system itself have been criticized for putting impossible pressures on teens. Outbreaks of suicides accompany every exam season. Wow. If your whole life depends on this exam, that's like so much pressure for one person to handle, especially if you're still growing as an adult. I mean, if this one test determines what happens in your life, that is really intense. The exam also includes a number of essays with prompts that can be notoriously obtuse, such as... Do butterfly wings have colors? Hold it. Why is this an essay question? Who do you admire the most? A biotechnology researcher? A welding engineer technician? Or a photographer? What the heck? That's like a, just a personality question. I'm so stressed. <laughs> the reason why China implements a Gaokao educational system is the huge population base. China has the second largest population in the world. The Chinese government thought that Gaokao is the only way to control teenagers, which give everyone a fair chance to get a better life. Also, it's a culture thing. Thousands of years ago, we already have Gao Kao in the ancient China, which called Keju system. People who did well in this task could get a well-paid job and promising future. It's kind of similar to today's Gao Kao. I attended Gao Kao in 2016, and I got a good grade which can get into the best university of my city. But that college is not good enough, which means it's not the top 10 university in China. And my cousin was wasting his time and learning nothing in that college. It's so weird that many of Chinese students working so hard and spend all of their time to the Gaokao and get into a good university, 
but they just playing video game and going to the party or club out there. So my father told me that, son, you'd better study abroad. And every parent in China want to have a smartest kid, but the fact is, not every student is a study type person. As a student who experienced Gaokao, I don't want my next generation suffer too much from that. This system is squeezing the creativity out of student. I hope it will be changing the future, but it takes time.